Jesus said the old to welcome me. Jesus said the end Welcome to today's edition of Believe. Another scripture that I love very much, you'll find again in Romans chapter 8, Romans chapter 8, verse 31. Romans chapter 8, verse 31. And this is what Paul was writing to the Romans in verse 20, 31 of the 8th chapter. What shall we then say to these things? If God be for us, who can be against us? If God be for us, who can be against us? Verse 32, He that spared not his own son, but delivered him up for us all, how shall he not with him also freely give us all things? If God be for us, who can be against us? I want to tell somebody here today, fear not, don't be anxious, don't be tense. God is for you. It means that in your life, your focus, your determination is very simple. Focus on one thing only, and one thing only should you focus on, that God is for you. God is for you. The Bible says in Genesis chapter 37 and 39, God was with Joseph. God was with Joseph. God was with Joseph. Prospered, Potiphar, prospered in the prison, prospered everywhere he went, prospered even in the pit. Why? Because God was with him. If God be for us, nobody can be against us. Nobody. There's no way that person can successfully come against you when God is in your corner. So it doesn't matter what the devil brings. It doesn't matter what the earth brings. It doesn't matter what your friends bring. It doesn't matter what your enemies bring. Everything that they bring will turn out for God's use and for God's purpose, because God is with you. He said also, he that spared not his own son, will he not give us freely all things? He says, God is ready to do anything for you, to give up himself, give up his throne, give up his own son, everything that he needs to do so that you'll be happy. It means that life shouldn't be that difficult. It means that life shouldn't really be that challenging. It means that life shouldn't be that upside down. It means that life shouldn't be that downwards if you have enough faith and enough belief that God is with you. God is with you. God is with you. So no matter what you are going through, just say it to yourself, God is with me. When I was going through challenges, I kept on saying, God must be here somewhere. And of course, God showed up. Believe and God will show up for you also in Jesus' name.